Hi, it's Chris from TechTablets.com here. Just looking at League of Legends, it's a request that I had to play it on the Surface and show the settings I've got it set at. At the moment, it's running at the native resolution. This is just a bot game, and you can see the frame rate is just up here in the top left-hand corner there. The frame rate seems to stay around 30 at the moment, and I will just test dropping the resolution, but I'll just get up to some action here. This is the tutorial thing at the moment, rather than actually play an online game and then have to leave it because I don't have time, because sometimes the games can be long and I don't actually play this game, but you can see with a lot of action going on, it's still around 30 frames per second. It's set on the medium settings here, hopefully you can see that. Now if I drop the resolution down to 720p, I'll see what difference that makes. Whether that will boost the frame rate or not. That has actually given us quite an increase there, so that's not too bad. So still medium settings there. You can play it on the native resolution, it seems to be playable. It says medium settings at the moment. And let's just test moving around the map, how fast that is. I mean, it's not choppy or anything, that's fast. It's definitely playable, very playable. Now the version of the uh, Surface that I have here, this is the 4GB version, so it has 4GB of RAM. That'll probably make a difference, it might make it a bit smoother. If you do get the 2GB version, you'll have to uh, take that into account that it could be a little bit slower, because it has less RAM. So you see moving around the map there, there's no problem. Let's go back to my character. So very playable, and you probably want to play it on 720p, just so it's nice and fast, 60 frames per second at the moment here without a lot going on the screen, but when there's a lot going on the screen it's dropping down. If you do want to run it on native then you'll have to put up with 30 frames per second, it's a little bit slower, but it does look nice. So that's uh, League of Legends. And now look at uh, Dota 2, I'll just show the settings, I'll set this on. So 1024 by 768, quite a low resolution, just to keep the frame rate up there, otherwise I think it's going to struggle a little bit on the tablet. And everything else is set on low, so it's shadow quality, low, texture quality is at, at low as well there. Let's go into a game now, just a bot game. I don't really know how to play this game at all, so just quickly show you. Okay, so in the game here, you can see the frames per seconds up here in the top right hand corner. Uh, it looks quite blocky and pixely because of the low resolution on the surface screen here. But uh, so far, it's, I mean, that's definitely playable frames per second. I'll see what happens when there's a bit of action on the screen, of course. Now, if you want it to look sharper, you can increase the screen resolution, but that will definitely drop the frame rate down. So moving around the map, there is some stutter there a little bit. You can see the frame rate does drop below 30 frames per second. So it's not entirely smooth, look, 19 frames per second just then. Okay, some action here, so we see how it fares. Definitely a little bit laggy.
Alright, I think that's enough looking at the game there. So you can see that it's going to be playable, but uh, there will be starter at times, and I guess when you have a lot of on-screen enemies and spells being cast and the effects and all that, it's going to have a big impact on the frame rate. But uh, at the moment it seems to hover around 30, but where there's a lot of action on screen, it does tend to take its toll on the frame rate there. And moving around, if I just try and move around real quick here, my finger touching on the screen, you can see it does dip down there, the frame rate. But uh, yeah, that's playable, but ideally you'd want to have it, of course, at like 60 frames per second, high resolution. But uh, this is just an add-on processor on the Surface 3 with 4 gigabytes of RAM here. So it's not doing too bad when you consider that. Alright, so that's the video there, just tested out those two games there that are quite popular online games. Thank you for watching the video, if you did like it please give me a thumbs up, and hopefully catch you on my next video. Bye for now.